lot of hard work, um, a lot of determination, um, really keeping on the girls and, and trying to keep them as humble as possible. Because when you have such success, you know, sometimes the success will get to you. And uh, if you're not grounded and humbled, you know, it does present challenges. So one of the things we've been focusing on is keeping the skills up to par, making sure the girls understand that, you know, there's one more to go, one more to go. I think that we all bring different experience. We all see different things out there on the court and we all have three different personalities. So I think once we merge all three, we're able to see the game from a different aspect that'll enhance the girls' skills, knowledge, and IQ of the game. Because we know that there are many teams across Ontario that could be in this situation, but we earned it. We grind every day and our hard work and our perseverance. Our foundation is defense. If there's no defense, there's no offense. So we've been working to this goal since the start of the season, and we have a lot of team chemistry to help us get there. Man, we, we worked so hard for this. We just came up and ended up beating the other team because how good we are. I feel, personally, I feel really honored to be able to represent my province because it's a big accomplishment to make it this far. Regardless, win, lose, ties, whatever happens, we've accomplished so much together. It honestly feels amazing. You and my team worked so hard to be here and hard work always pays off. I think I'm going to remember uh, spending time with my team, seeing other teams that we've never played against before, being challenged and having to uh, compete at the highest level. Personally, I think I'll remember meeting Jamal Murray and Superfan because they just showed us and told us like so many things they had to go through to get to where they were. And also, I really liked being close to my teammates and it's just a special experience. I'm just so happy. Having my friends and like playing all together, running around, playing hide and seek, winning games, and just playing our game how we usually do. Being able to spend time with the teammates and when we have bad games, you have them to cheer you up so you can play better. See all the different provinces that came to Toronto. Uh, we all came out here to compete and uh, you know, we all share something that we love and we're competing to be the best in Canada. You know, start off by setting goals. Um, have your goals ready to go at the beginning of the, of the year knowing that this would be your end goal. And just understand that it's not a sprint, uh, it's a marathon and it, it takes a lot to get here and don't worry about you know, small mishaps along the way. Stay with it and the success will come hopefully um, as you do that. You know, we've been um, going through this for a few years. Uh, a number of these girls have been with the club for five, six years and, you know, we've been in situations where, you know, they've always played up and they've always gotten beat and, in essence, they've taken their lumps and um, it's really rewarding that now that they get to play their age group, we've added some very key pieces that have helped us quite a bit and to go 50-0 and, and represent Canada in Orlando would just be, uh, would mean the world. And we are ready for GMBA. Oh,